here, and it's time to play Ark Survival Evolved. Oh, oh, oh! Oh, man. Oh, man. Update 232 point something is out. And there's a couple new dinos, guys. I'm super amazingly excited. This is the update that brings the dung beetle. That's right. We have some crazy mad poop gatherers coming around, guys. And we are going to go and tame some today. Now, I've been doing a few things to get ready. But before we get into all that, I want to take one second to thank all you guys for all your support on the last few, well, like all of them, but all the ARC videos and for all your likes, all your support. I super appreciate all you guys and I love making YouTube videos for you guys. Thank you guys so, so much. I hope you're having an amazing, amazing day today. I'm having like a super good day. Just like checking out the update, getting ready for it. Got my ghillie suit all repaired here. Let's get out a K. Look at this. Yeah, we got our ghillie suit all repaired up. Well, I guess not our hood. <laughs> I've been gathering a bunch of poo. From what I understand, the dung beetle likes to eat poo. And the larger the poo, the better it is. So that's like a whole thing. And from the dino spotlight video, it looks like we are going to find them in caves. So I think what we got to do, guys, is I've got, you know, I've got some meat in my inventory. Um, we're going to go ahead and grab a couple of bug repellent. Um, I had this made from beforehand, back when the spiders came out, um, during Halloween. So that's how long I've had this bug repellent in the fridge. For your informational kind of purposes, we will run over to the mortar and pestle just like super quick. Oh my gosh, a quack quack! It's a quetzal egg. I love quetzal eggs. We'll actually need those for like the second dino that came out, which is the Dimetrodon. Um, but that's not what this one's going to be about. We're going to be going after that dung beetle. Oh yeah, we're looking at ingredients. So if you want to make bug repellent, you need to have six pelt, two narcotic, four citronol, and four rock carrots. So it's a pretty spendy little recipe to make that bug repellent. And it's kind of funky because, I don't know, because it's got the pelt and the narcotic, it's strange to me that it does have a spoil timer. But that's totally cool, man. Let's put that on our hot bar, pop our quetzal egg into the fridge here, and then I'm going to head out to, to find a cave. All right, we are back, and we are at the base location of Chuck Molusky. Um, and there's a cave just north of here that I want to go and try and find one of these new dung beetles in. Um, but it's kind of in the middle of the woods, and I don't want to leave my Quetzal just kind of hanging out there. So instead, uh, Quetzalia is just going to hang out here, and we're going to, like, hoof it to the cave. I've got four insect repellent. I've got my ghillie suit on. So we should be pretty golden on the front of, like things seeing us and coming after us um because with the ghillie suit we can stay pretty like we can get pretty close to things before they actually see us which is super cool um to get to the cave we're gonna need to come over here and just pop right across the river hopefully there's no mega piranha um and then we'll kind of follow that rock line there everything dangerous out of the water leave me alone oh cool no fish no fish. So yeah, we are here, just leaving the um, the base location of Chuck Molesky's. His base is turning out super cool so far, and I've got an inventory full of large dino poos. Um, because the dung beetle doesn't eat meat, it doesn't eat berries, it doesn't eat kibble. Well, it will accept kibble, but the most effective thing that you can tame it with is uh, a good old piece of poo. Human feces is like the lowest, I believe, and then small, medium, and large. Large is your best for b taming effectiveness. So if we just follow this incredibly dark and scary jungle path, we should end up running into the cave really soon here. Um, we should almost be there. Yes, there is the entrance to the cave. We made it! We made it! Bow, 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 bow. We're totally cheering! So the cool thing about these dung beetles is they're going to actually make, like, natural fertilizer for us. I thought this was the entrance. Oh, I ran past it. Oh my gosh. This is the entrance I meant. Um, the cool thing about this cave, or not this cave, but about this dino, is it's going to make natural fertilizer and, like, oil as a byproduct. So that's, like, super cool. It's going to be the first thing that makes like natural oil from its like body and then um yeah the natural fertilizer so we don't need to be quite so up and up on the poop bins 
I'm super excited. Wow, this is like, I don't know if I've been in this cave. Super, oh, it's a cold cave. All right. And I have my crossbow with me to try and shoot anything like a scorpion before it would get to me. Anything down here? There's like nothing in this cave. Does that seem weird to you guys? Wow, there's still no mobs in this cave. That's kind of crazy. Kind of like super crazy. Hmm. Seems like something isn't right here. Oh, yuck. There's a scorpion. Shoot it. We don't even have bug repellent on. What am I doing? Hit eight. Bam. Kill this guy. Hopefully. Die. All right, scorpion down. Now we have like a fork in the road. Do we go left? Do we go right? Ooh, there's like a thing there. Anything cool this way? Let's go this way first because there's like stuff. And I'm not sure what this would be like without my ghillie suit and without the insect repellent. I'm guessing it would be a lot worse. Uh, but we're on like, you know, max difficulty. So there could be 120s in here and I just want to be safe. What's in here? Oh my gosh. Drop that garbo. A ramshackle cloth shirt. Uber. Oh, that's just a spider. Dang. I so thought that that might have been a beetle for a second. Oh my gosh. I just one shot killed that thing. Oh, oh my gosh. Guys, it's a stinking dung beetle. Um. Oh my gosh. How do we do this? What do we do? Is it passive? Feed large animal feces. Oh my gosh. Look at that! Put another one in our inventory. Is he hungry again? Oh my gosh, one large dino feces brought him up over halfway. Now we are in a times four taming multiplier on this server, so I'm guessing this is going to take two pieces, two large pieces to tame. And if you were on a normal taming multiplier, then it's going to take eight instead. Oh my goodness. And I want to stay away. There was some sort of a note about getting too close to them can make them aggressive. He's only level 12. I'm not too concerned about that. That's totally fine. Um, I want to get like a little army of these dudes so I can have them wandering around my dino yard like collecting it. You know what I mean? All right. Are you hungry again? Come on now. It does look like it takes a second for them to get hungry again. Oh my gosh. This is so awesome. And this may be, like, super overkill, having a ghillie suit and having the bug spray, but I'd rather be safe than sorry, and this will help with spiders and bats also in the caves here. Still not hungry again yet. I guess that large dino feces is, is pretty filling. Ew. And we've got 99.5% taming effectiveness, so that's, like, pretty awesome, man. Would you be hungry? Get an appetite! Let's look at this dude's face while we're, like, waiting for him to, uh, get a little hungry. Get down to his level. Oh, feed! Yes! We have tamed a dung beetle! Oh my gosh! This is amazing! Oily by by byproduct. Yeah, this is the part of the dossier that I was interested in. The oily byproduct is chemically the same as oil found in the oceans. So that's, like, super, super cool. We got our first ever poo roller. And that's his name. Pool roller. Um, oh, gender is N-A. Well, we'll just call him a him. That's cool, man. Level 17. Way to go, you little 17 dung beetle thing. Let's see if we can go find a few more. I really want to get, like, a couple. I've got... I mean, look at all the poo I have, guys. I've, like, collected a whole bunch of poo. So, yeah, let's see if we can get more. Oh my gosh, look at how super slow he is. Come on. You can make it, little dude. You can make it. I'm a little nervous about, like, how I'm going to get him out of here. If we run into anything, I'm afraid he might die. What are his stats like? I'm super silly. Yeah, he only has 240 health. Like, these guys have really tiny little stats. Um, oh, man. So I got to be super careful. I want to make sure that I don't accidentally, like, get him killed. What's over this way? Ew, there's like a ton of snakes, but there's another poo roller. 
Oh, look at all those stinking spiders. Oh my gosh. I really want that dung beetle, though. There's so many spiders and snakes right there. Oh, <gasps> did they just see me? Oh no, we gotta go. We gotta go. Oh, they're gonna eat him. No, no, no. Come on, little dude. Oh, no, no. They saw him. Poo roller. Poo roller. We gotta go. We gotta get him out of this cave. Those snakes are coming and they can go like right through the floor. Come on. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> Yeah, we're just gonna get this guy out of here and then um, bring him back over to Chuck's and then come back and see if we can get a couple more. Because um, I don't want to get our first guy, like, totally mortified. That would be terrible. Come on, Poo Roller. We gotta go. There were totally snakes after us. He's so slow. Doop, 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 doop. Oh my gosh. We finally made it. We finally made it up to the spot where there's a, a bed here. So, really quick, because I know that there's no mobs up here. I'm gonna go ahead take him off of follow and then head back down and see if we can find ourselves another little dung beetle to be his be his little poo partner his poo pal oh my god snakes no 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 i got too close just swing just keep swinging oh my gosh Ooh, a bunch oh no i don't want to get knocked out no 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 get dead get dead Oh man, our torp is going up. Our torp is going up. Our torp is going up. No, go down. Oh my God, no. 60. Oh no, we gotta kill this last one. Oh crap, we're dead, we're dead. Oh, we're so dead. Oh no. Oh no. There's nothing I can do. Oh no, it's over. <laughs> He's eating us. Crap, crap. Oh man. He was only a 68, too. Ah, crap. Well, good thing we got the dung beetle um, put back up at the bed there. Let's see. This is where we're at, right? Yeah, respawn at bed. Is there any chance that we could get our stuff back? Oh, no. <laughs> That's no good. Is our dung beetle still up here? All right, you're still rocking out. Hey, poo roller. Yeah, bad stuff just happened. Um, and now, unfortunately, I need to make the bad decision of just, like, sprinting down into the cave. I don't have anything on me, so I guess I don't have anything to lose. Other than the bad respawn point for five minutes. But Chuck's place is right by here. So, who knows? Maybe we'll be able to get our, our bag. It'd be nice if we could. I really would like my ghillie suit and all that kind of stuff back. I had some nice crossbows with, but if we don't get it, it's whatever. It's just... You know, you get used to dying in Ark. It, it's something that happens. <laughs> that was the best of us. All right. Oh, crap. Get the bag, get the bag, get the bag. Oh, no, no, no. Get it. Take it all. No, exit. Oh, we gotta go. We're stuck. Oh, we're stuck. Oh, we're out again. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, there it is. Oh, shoot. Oh no, a snake! Take all! Jump! Duck dive dodge! Ah, we're going, we're going, we're going, we're getting away! Oh my gosh, did we do it? Did we do it? I think we just got our stuff, guys. We gotta just keep running. Let's get out of here with this dung beetle and then go watch him do some stuff with some poo. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Who's a little poo roller? You're a little poo roller. Oh my gosh, these things are so goofy. Look at this awesome, like metallic crazy like shimmer that it, he has to him it's like so cool um both the brontos just dropped some little poos here so i want to get you over here before the timer is up and it says that they will do stuff with poo but only when wandering so let's enable wander and unfollow will you go and pick that poo please okay what if we just like um Oh, one out of our inventory. You going for it? How about this one? Oh, he's like swimming. What are you doing, man? You're not gonna pick that poo up? Can turn fecal matter into oil and compost, but only when wandering. Does that mean that we just put the... Um, the poo, like, right into its inventory? Like, like this? You know what I mean? 
now that you're wandering, are you gonna go ahead and like convert that? And I have a, I have a feeling it's gonna take quite a while for that to convert. Here, let's pick these up super quick, and see if I wonder could I put more on it and kind of like overweigh it. All right, so that's too big. Let's let's try a human poo. Where did that just go? There it is. How much does my poo weigh? Only point one. Wow, I could poop for days. Maybe a mo maybe a medium is gonna be a little bit better. See if we could weigh this thing down so it doesn't go wandering off into the wilderness. Bam! Five point six. All right, so now you're stuck there, man. You should be stuck there until you actually go ahead and convert that over to oil and compost. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Are you kidding me? Poo Ruler converted all that poo over so stinking fast. Like, it has been, like, not even 20 minutes, guys. And we have stinking fertilizer and 12 oil. Oh, man. Let's put some more poo in there. Uh, maybe not the large poo. Do we have medium? That's all large. That's all large. Well, whatever. But still, that is, like, super cool. Where are you, Poo Ruler? Come back to me. Follow me over here. Oh, my goodness. Like, guys... This is so stinking cool! Like, less than 20 minutes and we got that many fertilizer and oil from it? That is so much faster than gathering oil by hand and making fertilizer by the bins. Like, this is amazing. Revolutionary! I need to get a little army of these poo rollers now. Um, just so I can have some crazy fertilizer, like, making stuff going on here. Let's get him over by the farm because, you know, that's what he's for, man. He's making us the fertilizer. We'll just put him over here. And I'm thinking I'm going to need to make a little dung beetle pen um, on the side of the farming building here. Just so we can have a few of these guys on Wander making up the, th the fertilizer and the oil. Like, this is so cool. This is so stinking cool. But, alright guys, that is going to do it for today. I'm going to go after the Dimetrodon now. So, hopefully we got that out later too. As always, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I hope you have an amazing rest of your day. I will too. And this is Casters. Out. Up a tree. Clinging to a cloud. Um, up a tree.